Bada boom, bada pow. I don't know why that's nearly always the intro. But yeah, um, oh yeah, actually, let me do this before I forget. I know I was meant to change the music, but I'm just turning down the music quite a bit more. Because I think it was still quite loud yesterday. I'm temporarily testing out this little layout I've got. It's literally not even much of a different layout. I literally just made, like, this screen smaller. And then I just put, like, the Season of the Hunt, like, background on instead. Uh, chat is right above me. Did I? I don't think I did, did I? Oh, yeah, no, I did. So, it just stops just above my head. My head kind of goes into the border of it. And down here, just where my mouse is, that's where, like, um, chat would be. Or not chat. Donation. Or fucking donate. Follower notifications. There we go. Jesus. Right. It took me a while. And by the way, I didn't choose anything on this. Like, just when I went to the website, it just started up like this. So, yeah. Uh, I don't, I'm not going to lie. I don't want to scroll too far down. The comments can be quite... Um, quite aggressive. So, yeah. So, obviously, I decided, you know what? Let's do a little stream for, like, maybe half an hour. 45 minutes. Maybe an hour. It depends. Let us play Would You Rather, and especially because, like, I want to play this for, like, uh, Joe's Night Flares 9 to 10th Anniversary Series, and I thought, you know what, it'd be nice to start off with, um, you know, just something nice and chill. Then I'm going to have Sunday dinner, and then after Sunday dinner, we'll probably have a nice, like, good long stream. I think I want to try and see if I can stream for four hours straight. I think that's going to be my, like, new record if I can. Well, I say that, but I think I've already streamed four hours in the past, but shush. I mean four hours now, like, with Jonesy. But anyway, let's move on because that doesn't count. <clears throat> uh, so, would you rather live to be 200 in colonial times or live a normal lifespan modern day? So I'm guessing 200, like, like a long time ago or just normal today. Uh, there'd be nothing special about you other than you age half as quickly as you normally would. Uh, no, nah, I'd rather just live a modern life, honestly. I can't, I, I, I'm not going back to a time when we didn't have the internet and electricity, like, honestly. It's just as simple as that. Like, honestly, some of these I'll just answer real quick, and then other times it's like, nah. It's just nah. Uh, let's see. Would you rather be known as a drug dealer or be known as a liar? You won't be friendly, uh, you won't be friendly, you won't be the friendly neighborhood dealer either. Both are bad. Honestly, both are kind of shit. I'm not going to lie. Uh, a drug dealer or a liar? Well, I've never dealt with drugs before in my life. Or being a dealer of drugs, should I say. Um, so I don't know what that's like. Um, you won't be friendly in the neighborhood. But then again... Hmm. Maybe desperate times? Or we could just be a liar. Because, like, being a liar is just like... Hmm. See, the thing is, right? If I'm known as a liar, that doesn't mean I am inherently a liar. And being known as a drug dealer doesn't mean I'm actually a drug dealer. One could land me in the jail or, like, with the police... Or do a lot of fucking back and forth with the police. But one is literally just, like, a social kind of status thing. And, I mean, if you did, like known me as a liar and some people gave me a chance anyway just to watch and see how I did shit. They're like, oh wait, actually, he's not that, he's not an actual liar, like. So, yeah, that one. Oh, wow, people would rather be a drug dealer. Okay. <laughs> people really hold on to their fucking social status. Well, not really, actually. That's fucking plummeting your social status, like. Oh, Jesus, okay. So, <laughs> the, the title is just skinny and bad or fat and good. So, be very fat and ugly person with a ton of friends that will never get someone of the opposite sex. Be a very skinny and attractive person that has no friends, but can get any person of the opposite sex they want. Oh, I don't. Hmm. So, what's to say I, well, I'm not, like, bisexual or gay? What's to say that maybe... Oh, wait, no, that's still no friends, though. And you can get any person of the opposite sex. Because, like, if you're gay, then this is... This is, like, bro... Like, what the fuck do you do in that scenario, you know? Nah, yeah, I'd rather surround myself with people than not. Wow! People love to get the opportunity to stroke themselves off. Okay, I get it. Uh, be killed by Jason or be killed by Ghostface? 
So, Scream Guy or Jason? Jason, you know, Dying by Jason actually sounds cool. I don't know about the Scream Guy. I'm not really too up to date with that horror lore, so I'm just gonna <laughs> just pick that one. Yeah, a lot of people agree with that. Uh, would you rather eat your hands and feet or eat your whole dad? The fuck is this question? See, the thing is, right? Emotional damage. Uh, I would definitely be scared for the rest of my life. Or, there's nothing saying... Oh, wait. If you have to ask, yes, you would get help eating your own appendages. Assume your father is recently deceased. Damn, okay, thank you. Um, i still rather that. Because even with my argument, right? It's like... If you could get your, like, feet and hands surgically removed and you had the money to get them replaced. Like, let's say I was just a millionaire, right? I could literally just get um, replacement hands and feet anyway. So that's less traumatizing than that. But having to eat my own thing, I, I just... Somebody would have to slip in the meat and just... I'd, I'd be very cautious of meat, though. But, like, people would have to be like, I oh, know, yeah, I got this myself. But don't worry about it. Like, And there's nothing, there's nothing saying that you can't, like, eat it over time. Like, that guy who ate, like, an, an entire airplane, he literally ate it, like, piece by piece, day by day, like, or meal by meal, should I say. So, yeah. See, once you start finding the flaws in these, they're not that tough. It's only when they set specific ground rules that it becomes really difficult to, like, argue against. Selfish time traveler. So, go back in time and correct the, uh, the single biggest mistake of your life, or go way back in time and come up to, come up with the... Uh, Pythagor Pythagor the, the, Py Pyth you know what I mean, the theory uh, before Pythagoras uh, so, oh, Pythagoras theorem, that's it uh, before Pythagoras, so you can have an equation named after you I mean people are still not going to give a shit about me anyway, so but then again, I don't even want to go back and change things, as much as like people say oh, I wish I went back in time and changed this, this and this I'm kind of like, I don't know and for both options, you will immediately be sent back to the present after your actions. No double dipping. Well, obviously. Um, <laughs> because I, I don't think, like, you're going to go back to when he made that fucking equation. Live out your life until you get to the biggest mistake of your life. And then live on from there. Like, I think, like, I don't know. I, I, I don't even know how old the Pythagoras theorem is. So, uh, because I don't want to do that, I'll just do that. Why not? <laughs> Why not? I, I guess I'll stroke my own ego for this one. Would you rather be near death or hear everything two minutes late? Oh, fucking near death, honestly. Uh, that, that, like, as somebody that's been in a music course in college, like, not having something sync up with the video, like, I notice it instantly when I watch certain anime. Like, if they don't sync up the sound right, it literally pisses me off. And, like, if it's the whole audio for some reason that's, like, out of sync for the video, like, I will refresh it to see if it'll work. And if it doesn't refresh, I will have a fucking terrible experience watching that show, like, whatever I'm watching. Uh, if you're near death, you cannot use a device to help you hear. Everything will be completely muffled for the rest of your life. Oh. So I basically just turn into... Everybody turns into Kami-san for me. I'm just... They have to fucking write shit out for me. I don't know. Again, I think I... Fuck, I didn't think near death was that bad. Uh, whatever, I've chosen. I've spoken. Put a po uh, toothpick under each toenail and kick a wall or be scalped. Uh, you can choose which fall. Well, definitely not my left one because my left one hurts the most. Like my left uh, big toe. Be scalped. Does, does scalp... I don't know what scalped actually means. Mm, but I feel like... Have we got pain, suffering, violence and gro uh, gross... Ooh. Yeah, I'm sorry. It has to be that. Because if it is what I think that is, then that's horrible. Uh, mm. See, ugh, portal gun's cool, but it can only be used when moon dusts, um, like uh, walls and doors and floors are like in your vicinity. Uh, and then the gravity gun could be just used anywhere. So I probably will have to go with gravity gun just because of that. Because I don't think they thought about, like, if you sh could do thing or not, so. Oh, wow. I, I guess it makes sense, though, because a lot more people know what the portal gun is over the gravity gun. I think the gravity gun's from Half-Life? It's definitely in Gmod, anyway. And just being able to, like, lift anything you want with the gun is cool, but... Obviously, like, 
you'd use it more for like heavy artillery stuff. You wouldn't use it like if you were lying on your bed to lift something up across the room because that gun's like massive, you know. With the portal gun though, I think the portal gun's a bit smaller. Would you rather have a Pepsi have a Coke? Oh, this is actually, you know, actually that's a pretty chill question after all this shit. Uh, because I had Coke recently there, I'll just have Coke. Wow, we're all being brainwashed to like Coke. Would you rather only listen to the Beatles or Rolling Stones? Oh, I don't know. Ah, oh, find the Beatles because my mom likes the Beatles. Been a fangirl since they were around. Would you rather be electrocuted every time you swear or have all profanity censored out on your television? Hmm. Funny content. <laughs> Just funny content. That's all I gotta say about that one. Uh, only reheat leftovers for the rest of your life or pay to eat out at restaurants for every meal for the rest of your life. To be fair, right? Not all food that's reheated is bad. That's massively expensive. But then again, how do how would you buy leftovers? Still, though, leftovers, because I, I don't have that kind of money. If we're talking about myself. Or else I'd probably starve myself, actually. Other oh, wait, I could actually just ask other people to buy me stuff, and I'd pay them later for it. Oh, my God. Oh, wait, no, I said, yeah, only eat thing. Okay, never mind. Yeah, I, I, yeah. Have ice breath or fire breath? There's not a lot of times where I really want to light shit on fire. Even though it's cooler, I probably have the ice breath. Because if I could chill, like, the inside of my room, like, during summer, to make it more, like, uh, bearable, then that's nice. Oh, but then when you think about it, Joe, you could, mm, but then make it a fire inside, it's not really that safe. Okay, fine, yeah. I'm thinking logistically. Have a, a very attractive spouse that treats you badly, or have an ugly spouse that adores you? Um... I guess adores me, because I don't really want somebody to treat me like shit, or else I'll regret it, like. Like, regret ever, like, being with them, because it says this marriage sucks, so. <laughs> Added by deleted. Uh, have a stylist do your hair and makeup every day, or have a fashionista pick you a new outfit every day? Huh. Each makes you look great. All of the best makeup, styling tools, and clothes are available to you. So have a stylist do your hair, makeup every day, or have a fashionista pick you a new outfit every day. Fashion. I'd rather fashion over makeup. Uh, eat all the carpet in your house, or eat all the wood and tiles in your house. You would survive. Fucking barely. Um... I had ramen not too long ago. And there was bamboo in it, so probably wood, maybe. Yeah, we'll go with that, even though I didn't like it. Because I don't know anybody that can eat carpet, especially if it's really hairy carpet. Be a character in your favorite uh, in your favorite game, or be a member of your favorite band. I have to be game, honestly. I'm sorry. I can't play in a band, so. But man, uh, in your favorite game, I guess we'll just say Destiny 2. Be a character in your favorite game. Man, imagine Flyer 14 actually being a character. That would be mad. There's no other extra comment with that. Uh, would you rather sport a keychain nipple ring or have a wardrobe that is made up of outfits worn by the Scooby-Doo characters? Uh, <laughs> nipple pains. Consider Fred's neck scarf and unlocking your car door. Ooh, okay, they make a good point there. But then again, it just says, like, hmm. I don't know if there's enough rules to go off of, though. Yeah, that one. I'd rather not get my nipple pierced. Uh, would you rather star in Saved by the Bell or star in The Boy Meets World? I don't know either, so I'm just going to have to skip that one. Would you rather live in the Star Wars universe or live in Star Trek? Obviously fucking Star Wars. I know Star Trek is cool, but <laughs> either way, you're going to space. But yeah, no, Star Wars, honestly, getting a lightsaber. Oh, give me the fucking black saber and like we, we'll all be we'll, we'll be calm, bro. Everything will be fucking uh, lethal. 
If you had a machete, would you rather amputate the two or the feet of two friends or amputate one of your own feet? I mean, painful to get through two of them. They feel the pain. Nothing saying that, like, we'll take the procedures properly and then I'm the one that's just meant to make sure I, like, cut it properly and amputate my own foot. Which, again, in this scenario, if I was off well, I could actually just buy my own foot, so that one. Wow, people would rather cause suffering to others than themselves. Okay, I get it. Would you rather stub your toe or get a paper cut? Uh, there's nothing saying that when you stub your toe, it would actually hurt. Unless it's specifically my left toe, and it'll hurt like a motherfucker. We'll just say that. Just assuming that... You know, you literally just bang it for two seconds and, like, nothing really happens. Because people make a big deal out of, like, stubbing your toe and shit. And, like, I don't know. If you hit it at the right angle, like, unintentionally, like, you won't really feel it at all. But for a paper cut, you're guaranteed to, like, feel, some, uh, feel something from that. Would you rather put a toothpick under each toenail and kick a wall? Okay, yeah, we already answered that one. Uh, would you rather have to swallow every waking hour or have to laugh loudly every 30 minutes? Yeah, go on, I'll, I'll choose the psychopath way. Because that's like every waking hour, and then this is like every... Th oh, wait, I never thought about that, though. They Because this one says every waking hour, but this one just says have to laugh loudly every 30 minutes. What if you go to sleep for like 30 minutes, and you like laugh loudly? Unless you sleep laugh or some shit. We'll say I'll sleep laugh. I'm still sticking with my guns. Right. Would you rather be male with female features and body parts or being female with male features and body parts? Well, I am male. And thing. I mean, this is just just seeing, like, who's who at that point. Or seeing what would be <laughs> added by Chuck Norris. It's just called gender swap. So it basically it's just, would you rather be, like, female or would you rather be, like, female, basically? Uh, I, I guess since I'm male... I could, I could just identify as female, honestly, and still have my parts, so there wouldn't be a change. Yes. We'll go with that. Would you rather eat nothing for two days or eat the same meal for a month? Two days and a month. Would I rather starve myself for two days or eat the same meal for a month? I kind of already do that, so yeah, we're just going to go with that. Would you rather have no tongue or no... T uh, no, you cannot get dentures. They would uh, not be forcibly removed. You would just n uh, never have them to begin with. I'm assuming if I... Like, I try to keep my tongue shut right now. To see if I can still talk. I kind of can. But not entirely. My tongue is fucking going mental. It's like, why the fuck are you holding me back for? Like, you fucking idiot. Honestly, I kind of sound a bit... Like, alright. But, like, you know. I still try to talk as normally as I can, but... Hmm. Unless, like, once you get rid of your tongue, then it doesn't actually do... Like, it, you just can't speak at all. Hmm. Tongue helps with food. Teeth also helps with food, Joe. What's your point? We'll go with Tom. Why not? We'll go against the grain. Would you rather superheroes exist or Pokemon be real? Uh, I choose you. Yes, you could be a Pokemon trainer or perhaps a superhero. You'd not be allowed to pick your powers, which would be randomly given to... Select. So it's like, would I rather be in my hero or I'd rather be in the Pokemon world? It's basically what it's kind of asking me. Like, Um... Oh, super, like, when you think about it, right, Pokemon is kind of, like, cool in a sense, and the superhero world's a bit more scarier when you think. It's cool, but it's scarier. So maybe Pokemon. Yeah. We're almost on the 50-50 mark. What does this say? This question has not been reviewed by uh, either moderators. Come to maybe misinformative, offensive, or inappropriate nature. Would you rather have your elbow joints facing the opposite direction, or have... Oh my god, ugh. Um, so, that would mean... 
Your joints, elbow joints, that's this. Would you rather that facing the opposite direction? Does that mean like, hmm. Or have your knees facing backwards? <laughs> that's actually kind of a funny thought, actually. Yeah, that's a funny thought. That's the only reason I'm picking that one. Uh, your arms or legs bend the wrong way, basically, yeah. Would you rather actually have to laugh out loud every time you type lol, haha, lmao, etc. Or always have to replicate the face of any emotion you use? Um... Uh, hmm. Ooh, yeah, yeah, Joe, probably this one. Because I thought about, like, I think there's, like... Yeah, there's, like, a fucking pregnant emoji. So does that mean, like, I have to replicate being pregnant? <laughs> Do I have to become pregnant? Uh, so I actually have to laugh out loud. So, yeah, I could try and just cut down on them sort of stuff. Um... It's just like I'd have to use emojis instead of saying that. Because I say lol a lot. Like at the end of my like uh, messages. Would you rather eat a worm straight from the ground or snatch a fly out of air and eat it alive? <sighs> that, but basically the question is which one's like less dirty to me? Uh, oh, the worm would be fucking earthy but the fucking... Oh, the fly could have been anywhere. Literally anywhere. The worm is basically guaranteed to be in the ground. Whatever. Fuck it. I don't care. It's just like, we'll do it. Would you rather be the CEO of a Fortune 500 company, whatever that means, or be the president of a prominent country? Company? Yeah, company. Yeah. Like, sure, being president is cool and all, but... Fucking hell. We won't talk about governmental systems and stuff here. Would you rather be eaten by a lion or be eaten by ants? I mean, if I'm already dead, um... Beaten up by ants, because at least, like, my fucking uh, thing would remain. Would you rather not stop peeing for the rest of your life or not stop crying for the rest of your life? I guess crying, yeah. Honestly. Wow, 40% people actually said thing? Okay, never mind. I, sh I should stop judging people. It's just like, it's a quick choice, Joe. Nobody really gives a shit. Would you rather have a huge head and a small neck, or a huge neck and a small head? Um... Yeah, go on. I, I don't know. <laughs> just, I don't know. Uh, would you rather... Relive a specific moment or recreate a random moment? I think. Relive. Yeah, relive. Would you rather stare at the sun for two minutes or drink a litre of scalding water? The water temperature would be like an extremely hot coffee. Hmm. Okay, so. That's guaranteed. Drink a litre of scalding water, right? What if you just label it scalding water? And what if it's not actually scalding? You know? What if that's just the name of it? Even though it says extremely hot coffee, but shush, 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 right? And what if you just left it for a while for it to cool down and then drank it over time? Big brain. Big brain. Would you rather be a police officer or a firefighter? Two very noble jobs. Um... Fuck now. <laughs> when I think of fire uh, fighter, I think of fucking fire force, but that's not the same, Joe. That's different. Um, I'll be a coward. Less danger in my life, t theoretically. Because like firefighter, like you're always having to risk yourself. Like if you're trying to take out a fire, for most part, I think. And then, obviously, if you're police out. But then again, there's not saying that could be, a, like, a firefighter, but just, like, stay in the truck and make sure this truck's, like, all, like, geared up and ready to go. Shit. Or even be, a, like, a police officer, just stay at the station and be a secretary. Uh, be stung by 20 bees in random locations, or have each skin shin kicked hard 10 times. 
Ah, either way, it's going to be a very painful day. So we have 10 uh, kicks to the shin, which might actually break my shins. We're stung by 20 bees. I might have to save bees, honestly. As long as I'm not fucking getting, like, it's not, uh, well, it's still bad either way, Joe. <laughs> oh, okay. Would you rather burn to death or drown? Okay. Um, I think people are saying drown is somehow peaceful, so I'll just go with that. Would you rather have a first education holographic Charizard? I mean, I mean, this is like mad expensive nowadays, isn't it? Right? I I'm not imagining that, right? So, like, I would immediately sell that shit for a lot higher than 20 quid, like. I guess this is just for people who don't know what the fuck that is, like. Because, like, look at that, how? Like, I swear they cost quite a bit, like. Uh, Room of Snoop Dogg or Bob Marley? Um. Snoop Dogg? Wow, okay, more for Bob Marley. Wait, what did it say? You would be roommates and quite possibly BFFs. I, oh, he could have me on a track. That'd be fucking lethal, like. Yeah, VTubers. Shit be cool. Would you rather eat a container of butter or drink a bottle of maple syrup? The container would be the standard size normal uh, human beings buy from the grocery store. Wow, are you not human? You would not gain weight from, uh, from it either, so stop worrying. Weight wasn't even the first thing. My fucking stomach was the first thing that I thought about. And if I could even stomach something like this. Um, okay, let's let's make it more interesting, right? You have to eat it in that moment. You can't just space out over, over time like I've been saying a lot. Oh, yeah, actually with the beast thing, it's like stung random 20 places. I think that was a good one to go with because like that could be like random times. And then getting kicked in the shin random times could also count for that as well. But anyway. So, eat a container of butter, or drink a bottle of maple. Ah, fuck, we'll go with maple. At least it's sweet, I guess. I don't know. Uh, you don't want to be lonely. Would you rather only date people with severe OCD, or only date ch chain smokers? Wait, is it really that bad? <laughs> to fucking date someone with OCD? Like, bro. Isn't it, uh, organize something disorder? I mean, well, I'm not, I don't have a OCD myself, but sometimes I feel like, if it, is, if it is what I'm thinking it is, then maybe I kind of do anyway, but it's not that bad. <laughs> but yeah, no, I'm really turned off by, like, smokers. But honestly, that one in Helltaker, that last, like, one that smoked, she kind of had me feeling some ways. If you had to wear eyeglasses, would you rather need glasses to see far away or need glasses to see up close? No opting out by getting contact lenses. Sorry, guys. All right, uh, Jonesy, what glasses are you wearing? What prescription? Let's see. Need glasses to see far away or need glasses to see up close? Um, mm, up close. I don't know why, but my brain at the last minute was like, yeah, up close. I don't know why I feel like I want to see so far away better than up close, but yeah. Would you rather face a zombie attack or face a shark attack? Survival is not guaranteed. Could be one zombie the size of an ant that's just, like, as weak as a normal person, so... Hmm. But then again, zombie... Uh, no, I feel like a zombie attack is more, like, doable if, like, if it's just literally one zombie. We're a shark attack, I can't swim, so I'm dead. Would you rather soil yourself and not be able to clean yourself or change clothes for a week, or wear the same clothes for a year? If it means wear the same clothes for a year, that I'm wearing right now, and I could still take them off and clean them, but I'd have to put them back on immediately, and obviously I, I put other stuff on in the meantime to cover myself up, then yeah, that. I'd rather wear the same clothes for a year. Oh, wait, never mind. <laughs> you can't shower a mask to smell or was uh, your clothes for either option. You also may not layer clothes on top or strip. Therefore, you must keep shorts on in the winter and pants slash sweaters on in the summer. Uh, sweat in them. You also must resume everyday activities going to work, school, and may not stay at home. 
may not stay home, but like, what if I have no choice but stay at home? Like, I don't know. I still pick that anyway. This was before I read that. That is just, I don't know. That's that's a lot of ground rules. But wear, wear the same clothes for a year. I don't know. I guess maybe. Because that, again, nothing saying I could just, uh, like, shower with all the shit I have on right now. And then, like, have a system in place that allows, like, instant drying of myself and my clothes that I'm wearing. It would be icky, but yeah. Oh, but then again, that's for a week, though. But then again, this says, like, you have to still go to schools. Um, eh. I don't know. It's bad either or. Would you rather have your leg, left leg be painlessly amputated and only be allowed to use a peg leg as a prosthetic replacement? Or have one of your toes be amputated with a dirty cleaver every year until you have none left? I think I'm good with the peg leg, thank you. If you choose the blue option, you can take off the peg leg whenever you want and use a wheelchair if you please. If you choose the red option, your toes will be amputated on 1st of January each year, uh, and the cleaver has a 20% chance of causing a painful but non-lethal infection that lasts a month. Yeah, why would you not choose that? I'm so confused. That's such a shit one. Like, Would you rather have to get around on all fours all the time or only make animal noises? I mean, there's that one guy that lists off like salmon recipes in jiu-jitsu, so... Yeah. Again, I could literally just say that I'm mute from here on out. Something happened to my voice box and only be able to, like, uh, right thing. Anyway, uh, assume that walking on fours is just as efficient as regular walking, but you may never stand on two legs, and that is about a quarter of... And that is about a quarter of the noises would be understood by others. See, if I made all the other animal noises, I could still talk normally. I just have to sound like a parrot, right? Think about that. Be blind or be dumb. Dumb refers to the inability to speak. Oh, okay. I was just about to say I'm like, be dumb, but... Um, yeah, why not? I can still express myself in other ways. Would you rather not be able to feel any pain or have extremely brittle bones? Um, I guess not be able to feel pain? I think everybody else agrees. Would you rather marry a hardened criminal or marry someone with five kids from three previous marriages? Hardened criminals do more than just shoplift. Um... See, that's the thing, right? There's nothing saying that the hardened criminal wouldn't keep shit away from me anyway and not tell me, right? So if I didn't know, and then they found out I was in cahoots with him... And, like, they knew as well that I didn't know and that the hardened criminal vouched for me as well. as like, yeah, that I never told them anything. I just don't want... <laughs> Milf, Joe. Milf. Oh, but then again, you've been through marriages, so you might be a fucking dickhead or something. I don't know. Maybe I should have picked the dickhead instead of the criminal. Would you rather live in the Doctor Who or the Star Wars universe? Would you rather burp extremely loud every 30 seconds or let out a smelly, long-lasting fire every 5 minutes? People just get used to it. It's like, it's basically if I had a kind of tick, like, in a sense. Would you rather have surgery in a Mexican hospital or have surgery on the American Indian reservation closest to you? I'm assuming one's... Yeah, you know, fuck it, you know. We won't, we won't make any fucking discriminatory remarks against Mexican hospitals. Could be a really good place. Why is this not loading? That's actually kind of pissing me off now. Wait. Wait. There we go. That, that one, Joe. It's not loading anyway. Okay, cool. Would you rather have... Um, actually, hold on. Let me just check something. I always have to be doubly sure that I'm doing shit right. Oh, it refreshed, finally. Just when I did thing. Oh, why are you doing that, Joe? What are you doing? What are you doing? Um. Yeah, no, I don't think you saw anything. Yeah, you, you probably just saw that I have like a fiber page open. Just because of, uh. I was, uh, getting the next concept done for Sherry Arbor's story. Which, by the way, will be at the end of D3 2022, whenever that comes out. And also, have you ever heard of Sherry Arbor's story? It's the light novel series I'm working on. You should subscribe to the Joe Snow Flare channel to see more of it. Right, anyway. Uh, would you, When you go to bed at night, would you rather have a deranged elf pour a bucket of water on you every 15 minutes? Here and... 
don't know. I guess just here. Okay, I, I'm not going to answer it. It's just because they can't even write out the fucking sentence. Like, where the thing. Would you rather only be able to whisper or only be able to shout? When speaking, it is always in the same volume. Volume, no surgery allowed. Um... Shout. Because, let's be real. Because if I just talk like this all the time, people will just get used to it. They just think I'm really enthusiastic. And if I'm in pain, people will actually be able to hear me, you know? Especially if I need help somewhere. Even if I have to keep it at this tone at all time, you know? Like, ah, you know? But then when I whisper, when I whisper, it's going to have to be like probably something like this quiet, right? And like, if I'm in pain, I just go, ah. And then when I need to call out for help, like nobody's going to be able to help me when I'm whispering this quietly, you know? Hope that was good ASMR. <laughs> I still need to do an ASMR stream at some time. I should line up some objects. Would you rather skip summer or skip winter? Sorry. Sorry, Christmas. I'm so sorry. Uh, would you rather never be able to compliment or never be able to complain? Nothing nice to say. Um, I guess not be able to complain. Oh, I fucked myself over with that. If I have to get a refund on something, technically that could be counted as complaining. Fuck. I could just ask somebody else to do it for me. But then again, I, could, I had... Mm. See, I would just say, like, hey, could you please refund this, uh, my friend? You know, in a tone that's not complaining. Uh, would you rather eat the same three meals a day for the rest of your life or eat what, whatever you want but have to eat poop sandwich once a month? I can't handle shit. I'm sorry. You're playing Connect 4 against an emo emotionally unstable man with an explosive temper. Would you rather take him down or let him win? Yeah, I'd rather let him win. Would you rather be, this, be a student the rest of your life or be a teacher the rest of your life? Be a teacher sounds painful. If I'm a student uh, in college, for example... And if I was doing the same shit I was normally doing, and if I could continuously be a student regardless of failing, and do my own shit on the side. Hmm. But Joe, an actual job. <laughs> Just a job. Yeah, fuck it. Why not? Go for, go for a teacher. Would you rather blind uh, with amazing... Oh, you, oh, so would you rather be blind with amazing uh, music ability, or deaf with amazing artistic ability? It would help me when writing Sherry Arbor's story. I could actually, instead of writing a light novel, I'd basically just make a manga at that point. Would you rather prevent 9-11 or prevent the deaths of three people you choose? Um, I heard it did a lot on the stock exchange. Like, mad shit like, happened during that time. Prices like soared and so on and so forth. So, yeah, probably that. Uh, if you were stuck in the woods, would you rather have a tomahawk or have a knife? Tomahawk. I feel like I could do more of a tomahawk than a knife. It depends, though. And plus, I could make more tools for myself, so, yeah. <laughs> would you rather go to heaven or hell, or be re reborn into a better slash worse life? Uh, where you go depends on how you live, good or bad life. I think... It'd be interesting... Oh, but it doesn't say that I'd re be reborn with memories, though. Ah, oh, whatever then. Fine. Go to heaven. Uh, would you rather have comically large feet or have a comically oversized head? Large feet. Think about it, right? Both would be at least twice normal size. No other size upgrades included. Ah, they said that on purpose so it wouldn't be like my dick size would be bigger. I was about to say, like, you know what they say about guys with big feet. But, um, what was I going to say as well? Fucking, like, uh, normal size. So, if normal size is average size, and I think the average would be like, Six to eight, maybe, size. And I'm, like, 11. That would literally just be an extra, like, big size for me. Unless it's twice my current size, then I'd have to get fucking shoes that are 22, like, uh, in size. Which is... I don't know what the actual measurements is. It's just shoe sizes in UK and Ireland. Would you rather be uh, topless all, all the time or be pantless all the time? 
it would encourage me to start actually fucking um like I guess working out a bit better and actually get rid of my back knee and stuff, so yeah. And being pantless all the time is kind of just like strange. Would you rather work at McDonald's or Burger King? I don't know. I guess McDonald's. No real preference. Oh, excuse me. I'm sorry. Ugh, hiccuping now for some reason. Uh, for the rest of our... Yeah. Uh, for the rest of your life, would you rather eat every meal mixed with carbonara sauce or drink every drink mixed with four loco? I don't know what that is, so I'm going to have to go with that. And if I had to eat every meal with thing, I, at least for most meals, I could just plan out what thing is. And even if people gave me other meals that, like, had carbonara sauce on, I could just work around it. Carbonara. Yeah, that's that sauce, isn't it? I think. Would you rather be able to survive any injury or fall, or be able to pull out any Acme Corporation product out of your pocket? Uh, oh, a substance area of the Roadrunner Corporation. You cannot use one ability to achieve the other. Pulling out a parachute to survive a fall, skydive into Acme Corp warehouse. I mean, survive any injury or fall, like. That sounds kind of gas, like. Unless it's really painful, but yeah. Mountain Dew or Dr. Pepper? Uh, Mount, or uh, Dr. Pepper, sorry. My fucking brain and mouth and hand went different ways. If you're having a baby and the technology existed, would you rather genetically alter your child or leave it... To yeah, leave it in a chair. What the fuck? Uh, alterations could include anything from the sex of the baby to hair color, eye color, height, skin tone, removal of any defects, etc. <laughs> Maybe for the sake of Sherry Alper's story, I just <laughs> literally make a child that looks exactly like Sherry. But nah, don't leave it to nature. What the fuck are you on? Like, what? Uh, would you rather be a shark or be a dolphin? So, would I rather be cool or a rapist, is like the two questions I'm getting here. Probably a shark, yeah. Not to say that sharks wouldn't do thing either. Sorry for being uh, vulgar with that uh, comparison. Would you rather be the best known person in a small band uh, that under 200 people know, or be some guy on the sidelines of your favourite band? Uh, be some guy on the sidelines of your favourite band. Be some guy on the sidelines of your favourite band. I guess, maybe? There'd probably be better popularity with that, right? Would you rather be the student who always sleeps in class or be the student who always talks in class? I don't think I got enough sleep. And even if I was talking, I wouldn't be listening, so... Yeah. Less likely to be caught, maybe? And, like, it, let's just say, right, I went back to a certain point in secondary. Like, let's say I went back to doing my leaving, right? If teachers noticed I started sleeping during classes, and they knew how, like, much I used to, like, always stay awake and stuff, they'd probably let me off and sleep, honestly. Well, some of them. And I could be waking up anyway. Would you rather know when you die or know how you will die? So, a timer or how I'll die? Fuck, it scared me for the rest of my life. Ah, oh, but if I know, if I knew how long I would live for, I'd fucking do so much shit, like. I would just be doing a lot more than I am now, like, I wouldn't be taking life as chill as I am. Oh, whatever, we did it. So, would you rather win the World Series or win the Super Bowl? Don't know either or, but Super Bowl is big for its ads. A lot of people watch it, so win the Super Bowl. Probably get a lot of money from that as well. Would you rather always know when people are lying or always get away with lying? You would never be caught for telling a lie. Hmm... I'd rather see the manipulators than be the manipulator. Oh my god, I never thought about that though. What if, 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 what if right? Somebody accuses you of shoplifting, right? 
This is going to go in a fucking weird tangent. Uh, but let's say you had to for whatever reason. You could lie and saying like for some reason like whatever cameras weren't there or even like you had something on that covered your face, right? If you lied about you not being the person on the camera robbing the thing, you'd probably get away with that. <laughs> you could get away with so much shit. So I never thought about using it in a malicious and the social setting. I thought of you, well, in that setting, I never thought about that. Eh, I don't know. I guess it's better anyway to know when people are lying. I'd be a fucking brilliant detective, honestly, now that I think about it. Uh, would you rather own a personal helicopter or have an incredibly nice car? You cannot sell or trade either. But what if I can't use either either? What if I gave it to someone? Oh, no. Yeah, no. See, it's not a trade, though. It's a gift. If I gift it to someone... Yeah, if I gift it to someone, even if they didn't give me the money back for it, they'd still be getting money for it. I know a helicopter would probably cost more. No, but some cars can cost a quite a lot of money, so, yeah. And plus, it's easier to get around. <clears throat> would you rather use only Windows Me for the rest of your life or use only a 16-inch seat RT monitor? I've no clue what that is. Um, but that kind of sounds like cool. <laughs> I would never be able to stream properly, but it's kind of cool. <clears throat> and see, mm, oh no, I just thought about if I had more than one screen, but... Eh, whatever, it is what it is. Would you rather be stung by 20... Oh, I've already did this one. Uh, oh, fucking hell. Okay, if you had kids, would you rather regurgitate food to feed them or lick your children to bathe them? Ugh. I mean, assuming I could actually do it properly and it's not horrible, I guess. I don't know. This one's a fucking weird question. Would you rather get run over by a car and die or kill five small children with your car? Yeah, um, I know if I pick the other one, I am going to be put uh, on a watch list. Would you rather live in a world with no spiders but all of the bugs at their current population or live in a world with only spiders but with 50% increase to their current population? See, fuck. Um, wait, what's to not say though that we all become spiders? Because like, if you live in a world with only spiders, oh, but then if you're like the only one, then there's people, spiders. The ecosystem would probably be fucked up, but like, it wouldn't be that bad. It would probably find a way to heal itself over time. Would you rather eat only chewed up food from out of a toothless elderly person's mouth, or eat only chewed up food from out of a young chain smoker's mouth? Both is bad. Old person has bad breath, young smoker is just ordinary looking. Uh, I mean, I, 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 at least it's smoky. <laughs> it's just like, I don't know. Uh, uh. Would you rather be attractive but get punched in the face every morning, or be ugly? Yeah, I'd rather just be ugly then. Because, I mean, I don't want to feel pain every morning. Would you rather be deaf and have no legs? Or be blind and have no arms? Um, I guess no legs. You may not get any prosthetic limbs or corrective surgery. You're stuck with it. Okay, cool. We'll just go with that anyway. Um, Because, honestly, I kind of do value my sight. My sight is, like, the last good thing I really have on me. Unless I improve my voice, then I could have a better voice, but yeah. Or a singing voice. Would you rather be horribly uh, horribly and hopelessly depressed or have inescapable, overwhelming anxiety? Both are bad. I guess, I don't know. Would you rather always be late or always be uh, unprepared? You would be more than 20 minutes late consistently. Unprepared means that you wouldn't have what you needed for most activities. People would know this and they'd help me in advance. Mm, but then again. Uh, 20 minutes late. Fuck it. Would you rather have stinky feet or have long fingernails? I mean... You can clean your feet... And cut your nails. But I'd rather clean my nails. Or cut my nails, should I say. Would you rather have the first dibs every time. Or always have the last laugh. Mm, but what if it's the first dibs in the shit thing? 
assuming it oh, fine why not it just because like if it's a good thing it's good if it's bad then it would make for great content uh would you rather be un unable to survive without eating something every hour be unable to taste anything for the rest of your life um eating something every hour would be expensive but if you go through a normal thing... I mean, I guess I could just eat shit that's, like, actually healthy for me. It'd be such a shame, though, because I wouldn't be able to actually taste it. I'd still be able to smell it, probably, to a certain degree, but... Fine. Yeah, we'll go with tasteless. Would you rather kill someone you hate and get caught? Or, and get caught. Or kill someone you love and never get caught? Sorry, Floppy. I think you have to go. <laughs> I just, um... Oof... Right, jail time for me. Would you rather take a cold shower every day or take only hot showers just once every two weeks? Fuck, that's horrible. Especially with the amount of time I've fucking done thing. I guess cold. Yeah, I'd rather shower every day then. Even if it's bad for me. If you had to eat one, would you rather a hamburger or a hot dog? I love the way... The, 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 like, some of these questions are actually kind of chill. Uh, you know what? I'd rather Hamburger. Would you rather eat an apple or eat in a pear? Um, yes, they're both freshly grown. No preservatives. Both are uh, sanitary. Consider this question with no catch. You're welcome. Yeah, an apple then. Would you rather wrestle an alligator or wrestle a bear? You will feel a ton of pain. Um, fuck. I don't think I can. Now, assuming if I had the strength to rival it, I think it'd be cool wrestling a bear. And plus, we're on land, so, like, it's easier to, like, wrestle. Would you rather be uh, Calvin or be Hobbes? I don't know what thing is. I'm not arsed to click into it either. Would you rather only eat KFC for a month or eat Taco Bell? Uh, KFC, because I've never tried Taco Bell. Would you rather have an iPad or an iPhone? iPhone. If you saw a gang beating up a stranger, would you rather call the police but they don't get there in time? Or intervene and save a life but take an equally horrifying or horrific beating? I think it, I think they always kind of say anyway to not engage, so I think I'll just go with that. Yeah, okay, I'm, I'm morally wrong in this one. Would you rather be a content failure or be, be an unhappy success? Failing success would be in relation to something you care about. Um. I don't know. Be a content failure or be an unhappy thing. Failing success would be in relation to something you care about. So I'd be a content failure if I continued letting YouTube fail. Or an unhappy success if YouTube did take off and gone from there. Unhappy so I could help others, I guess. Which superpower would you rather? Superhuman memory, ability to retain all information learned, which is not even actually a superpower. It's actually, like, it's a thing some people can be born with. I know, like, I heard somewhere before that there was a girl that was literally, like, basically, I think she said, like, she can recall, like, even when she was born. Like, when she was... So somewhere around the time when she was first born. She re recount memories from then all the way till now. Like, which is so weird to think about. But teleportation uh, teleportation's really cool. Like, I mean... Yeah, teleportation's cool. Like, bro, imagine this, right? <laughs> like... If, like, like... If someone's just too far away for you to just walk, you're like, Alright, let me just uh, teleport to your location. Like, it's so, it's, like, teleportation so under, like, rated, honestly. Compared to, like, flying and shit. Like, flying is cool, so you get to see sights and stuff, but you can always just teleport yourself into the air and fall a bit. You know, you, you can practice skydiving and be able to teleport away, like. Anyway. No electronics, no friends. Um. People can have the electronics for me. Would you rather be naked at... Oh, yeah, and I, for this as well. I could just get an office, so I'm not technically living with the electronics, honestly. Would you rather be naked all the time or never leave your house apartment? I'd never do that anyway, so let's fucking go. If you had to be tortured, would you rather enter a... 
Sicilian bull or wear Spanish boots? I have no clue what those... Oh, wait, I think... Oh, that's... Oh, yeah, that's the one where the belly of the bull is, like, heated up a lot. And the Spanish boots, I'm assuming, is, like... Maybe... I feel like there's, like, going to be ants in there and we're going to do things, so... Uh, both are painful. Ugh. Fuck, now that I'm thinking about too much, just fucking pick one and go. Would you rather vacation in New York or vacate... I mean... The same is spent in both locations as well as the essentials. I mean... <laughs> I mean, Konnichiwa. Nihongo Dezu? I have to, I'm sorry. Wait, what? Wait, oh my god, it's... it's Wow, okay, it's a lot different. I thought, like, it'd be more 50-50 than 52-48, but... Uh, yeah, no. I like I know I can't speak it, right? But it says right. Uh, so, same time spent in both locations as well as essentials. Uh, and s assuming I'd spend time on the essentials getting to there, then yeah, um, yeah, whatever. Uh, you would you rather never understand the concept of time or never understand the concept of sex? Meaning you will not be able to tell time or anything related to time and never understand anything involving sex. Masturbation would be really weird then. Or would I even? You wouldn't actually, would you? If I never understood time. Ooh. It'd be interesting to see how that would go. Would you rather take a picture or have your picture taken? Oh, <laughs> just, okay. Um... I'd rather have a picture taken, because last time somebody took a picture of me, they made me look really good. Or made a uh, Joseph Bamium. Oh no, Joseph Bamium. There you go. If you played football for a living, would you rather play quarterback or play... I don't know either. Would you rather be unable to survive without eating something every hour? Uh, so, would you rather have your name known forever for doing something terrible, or never be recognized for accomplishing something wonderful? I'm, I'm too self-conscious. Uh, would you rather be dissolved feet first in sulfuric acid or have a mafia hit on your family? If A, you have zero percent of surviving. If B, uh, they have zero chance of survival. Right? Guess I'm sacrificing myself. Eh, if I sacrifice myself for family. For the rest of your life, would you rather eat every mi meal mixed with carbon? Oh, we already did this one. Uh, would you rather always watch Nicolas Cage movies or always watch Thing? Assuming I just have to watch them once over and get over with it, then yeah, I guess Nicolas Cage. Would you rather Death by Firing Squad or Hanging? Uh, firing Squad, I guess? Uh, would you rather be hung by a... What the fuck are all these fucking depressed answers like or questions? Uh, fucking... Tacapitated, bro, get me out of here instantly. Uh, would you rather eat a container of Flintstone <laughs> vitamins or drink a bottle of uh, Pepto Bismol? I don't know what that is, but uh, I'll eat the Flintstones. Would you rather only eat uh, stuff stuffing for the rest of your life or only drink gravy for the rest of your life? Stuffing. Stuffing could be wildly like, yeah. If you were an e and. If you were, if you were an evil mastermind, so it's meant to say, if you were an evil mastermind, would you rather have your lair be underwater or have your lair in the side of a cliff? I think on the cliff side, I think there's better chance of survival somehow. Would you rather be the CEO of? A, oh, we already did this one as well. Would you rather light your hands on fire for a minute or light your feet on fire for a minute? I think my feet would fare better in that scenario, so. Would you rather chop off your own arm, chop off a complete stranger's arm, but they come back to kill you in 30 years? So I'm dying or chop off my own arm? Okay, cool. I guess I'll... If I live, if I do it right, if I go through the procedures and chop off my own arm... Again, we can go through the whole, oh yeah, if it's done properly in this proper place, but I'm the one that has to cut it, yeah. Would you rather be able to freeze time for one hour every 24 hours or be able to replicate one thing per day that disappears after 24 hours? Wait, so be able to replicate one thing. What do, what do they mean, one thing? Like, could I replicate myself and then just do a video with my twin? Nah, I think freezing time would be fucking cool. Like, hmm. 
Because, see, during that time as well, sure, I could get bored, but I could also just be like, right, Joe, this is your hour to chill now. The world stopped just for you to take this break. So I go out for a walk, steal some money, and, and come back home. Nah, I'm joking. Um, I would... What would I do? Yeah, no, I think I'd just chill during that time. Maybe go out for, like, a long walk or something like that. Would you rather be Joker or be Bane? Hmm. Bane. He got he got those muscles, though. Would you rather work 10 hours a day, 4 days a week? Or work 8 hours a day, 5 days a week? Oh, okay. So this is just asking if I had a job, which one would I rather? So 10 hours a day. That's not to say that I won't have breaks. It's a really long day, but that's 4 days a week. And then work 8 hours a, a day for 5 days. I think... Hmm... Yeah, go on. Well, I've already gone to school. I know what it's like. Would you rather save Abraham or JFK? No real preference, but I think history could change. For both of them, but yeah. Would you rather be a regular on a daily soap opera or make one-line cameos in three large Hollywood blockbusters each year? Yeah, Hollywood blockbusters. Would you rather forget who you were or forget who everyone you know is? Uh, then close to you uh, would not disappear, but you would not remember anything about them. You can rebuild with time, but you will not get back the lost memories. Forget who I am or forget who everyone you know is? Forget who everyone you know is. Because you can chalk it up then to just, I have like amnesia. I only remember myself and my other, I guess my own shit, but... Oh, uh, I don't know. Because, like, this is basically just forget who you are. Actually, maybe that would have been better. Shit, yeah, I actually would have went with that. Never mind. Would you rather be homeless or be a slave? Being a slave means uh, being an unpaid servant that can't quit or leave. This is not necessarily a slave in the historical sense. So, unpaid servant can't quit or leave. Be homeless, because I feel like there's a higher chance of me being able to get out of homelessness. Would you rather have 150 in quarters or have $100 uh, in paper money? You can't exchange your quarters for paper money. You have to spend them as quarters. Same goes for paper money. I mean, more money is more money. Would you rather... <laughs> would you rather... Would you rather... Be chased by 100 rabbit squirrels uh, through a flat open plain. Go down a 200 foot slide completely made out of ice head first with your shirt off. Assuming I'd slip and not have anything proper, yeah. Um, seems probably better. Probably could actually do. Live. Would you rather be unable to survive without eating something every... Oh, fucking same question again. <laughs> For three minutes, would you rather play with dog do like Play-Doh, or sit, with, uh, sit in someone else's warm... Oh, fuck, what are these weird questions? The urine would not be shallow. These are fucking weird, man. Nothing saying I can combine that with um, fucking dirt, I guess. I don't know. I don't know, man. Could wa wear a mask and so on and so forth. Would you rather only uh, Brutal Metal, only Justin Bieber? Um. Oh, wait, I don't... Is that like an actual person? I don't know, then. I'm not going to choose just on that. Would you rather be haunted by people or... Uh, Oh, hunted by people or hunt people. Your safety is up to you. Um, I guess hunt people? I don't know. Like, I could be hunting important, like, uh, bad people, I guess. Would you rather give a speech to the whole nation or have to sleep with tarantulas on your bed? Yeah, I'd rather, sp I'd rather public speaking. Would you rather uh, be Slytherin or Gryffindor? Um, yeah, Gryffindor. Would you rather get $100 today or get $1 a day for 200 days? I mean, we're getting $200, bro. Just taking some time. Would you rather lose an arm and one foot or lose a leg and one hand? Lose an arm and one foot. And there's no saying I can get these back. 
so I could just get him back as prosthetic. I lose a leg at one hand. I think I'd rather lose the leg. Because I think the arms are better to, like, have natural. And obviously the hand I'm going to have to have prosthetic. Would you rather sleep in a room a little too warm or a little too cold? Um, a little too warm. Would you rather fight Spock or fight Kirk? And this is like um, Star Trek, so I don't know. Would you rather live an extra 50 years or be guaranteed entrance to heaven? Bro, did fucking church make this one? Um... Let's see what 50, extra 50 years would be like, as long as it's not pain and suffering. Would you rather have all expenses paid two month vacation to France, or be on the moon for one... Oh, moon, sorry. No, I, I... Like, imagine! That's a conversation starter and a half, right? You're taking someone out on a date. They're like, oh, so where have you been? Uh, have you done any traveling? I'm like, yeah, I've been on the moon for one hour. That, there would be so many questions. And you could prove it as well. Like, bro, why would you want to go to France? You could go to fucking France any time. Like, the moon is a once in a lifetime opportunity right now. You know? As it currently stands. Like, there's no tourist, like, fucking rocket that goes back and forth between Earth and the moon. Like, would you rather be born a dwarf or be born without a third of your legs? Without the without the one third of your legs, you would still be able to run as fast as nor a normal person. So I basically it's asked me would I rather be a dwarf or short, right? I think that's what it's asking. Yeah. Uh, superhero, super villain. Uh, the power is neutral. It could only. It could be used for either good or e evil equally. I guess because I'm writing about Joe Knight Flyer and Sherry Arbor's story, a superhero. Because there's no guarantee you'll succeed in either or. Would you rather live in ancient Greece or ancient Egypt? Greece, I think? Yeah. Would you rather uh, watch Are You Afraid of the Dark or read Goosebumps? No, no clue. Uh, would you rather be Calvin or be Hobbes? I think I've already read that one. Would you rather appear... Uh, appear... Uh, emit robot noises whenever you move? Or make camera shutter sounds whenever you blink? Um, I mean, there's nothing saying these sounds are loud. And, like, if you're only hearing this to yourself... Yeah, that, because it's less thing. Would you rather be trapped in a sandstorm or a snowstorm? Um, fuck, I don't know, actually. I'll just say snowstorm, because that's what I was thinking of picking first. Would you rather have every song you ever listened to turn into Nyan Cat? So basically Rickroll, but Nyan Cat. Or have every movie you ever watched turn into Badgers, Badgers, Badgers? I don't know what that is, so I'll just say Nyan Cat. Uh, the change would be both abrupt and inevitable. Would you rather have 2 million YouTube subscribers or have 1 million Twitter followers? Um... Huh. Interesting. Subs. We'll go with that. Nothing saying that this would bleed into the other. So. Uh, be disemboweled. Right, last question. Would you rather be disemboweled by a Japanese sushi chef and served on a platter to Justin Bieber, bro, the fucking hay, or run through a pride of starving lions wearing Lady Gaga's meat dress? So, this is death, but this isn't guaranteed death, so we'll go with that. Right. Thank you so much for watching this stream. I actually thought I could go for a bit longer, but I guess not. This was Would You Rather, uh, or should I say either dot, let me like open thing for a sec, uh, either dot io. Uh, so yeah, if you do like this stream and if you've viewed, uh, well actually there's no point asking me doing this game because I think I've, I've already got a lot of repeat questions so I don't think I'm going to bother. But if you do want to see more streams, make sure to follow me live on Twitch, uh, twitch.tv slash Joseph Flair. If you watch this on YouTube, make sure to uh, like the video if you liked it, comment if you want, subscribe if you want, and hit the bell if you do so desire. 
and I'll see you in the next stream probably later today. See ya.